Hi, and welcome to Stammeron with me, John. But today, I'm going to be taking you guys out and we're going to do some bits and bobs in town. We're going to have a little walk. Um, I need to go get some uh, some medication. Um, I need to go and sort out an opticians and I need to, and I'm going to go grab um, a coffee um, as well. So let's let's go and let's see what it's like to be a a stammerer and to do these things let's go so we're gonna go to shop now these are everyday tasks which i should be absolutely okay with and you know i'm normally okay with but because of the psychological thoughts that i've, I've always had whenever i have to go to you know town or a shop and i know where i have to speak irrespective of whether i'm fluent i'm good i'm fine there's always that initial um thought in my kind of head i start to go over what it is i'm out for and what i need to ask so let's see how we get on so when we get to the shops i'll have to just maybe hide the camera so people don't think I'm mental. <clears throat> yeah, so let's go. So things I'm thinking about now are I need to go to a shop. I need to get medication. That's for bipolar. Um, and the interesting thing about that is is that you, you have to say a name and uh, where you live of course you do but for a person that stammers I mean that can be quite hard especially if there's a queue behind you so I'm already in my head repeating my name over and over and over and over again which sounds really really silly but that's um that's the part of stammer that people don't understand is that a name fear of everyday tasks you know and the psychological impact that it has on people even 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 if you're fluent enough and you don't stammer all the time the the impact so your brain is um, it's quite it's quite immense. So uh, yeah, let's do this. Oh, okay. Um, 
doing Saturday, I just need to change that. Uh, Oh. Yes. When would you like to move that? To uh, when's the next available? Okay. Um, yeah. 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 Does that sound good? Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. yeah. If not, then we've got the one on Saturday. Do you want to do the following Saturday? Right. Yeah. 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 Right. Morning or afternoon. Thank you very much. Right. Have a good day. Bye now. Take care. Bye. Biscoff cheesecake, please, and a uh, medium black Americano, please. Mm -hmm. Yes, please. Thank you. So, other than the fact that the prescription was not there, it's quite successful, I think. Um, yeah, the inane thoughts of a stammerer is ridiculous. Um, you know, there's nothing you can really do um, about it, really. I mean, you can, you can, you can try. You know, you you, you sort of need to, to have all the therapy and just talk about it. But the main thing with the stammer is to um, is accept who you are, which is fine. I'm a fine one to talk about this, but the best person to talk about this because I didn't accept it and try to hide it for the best part of 40 years which didn't help anybody didn't help me so it doesn't mean that you know just because sometimes I can I can talk or I'm fluent and I can talk into this um, doesn't mean that you know the, the, the thoughts of Stumble will ever go away or, or the reasoning behind it or the things that I attach to it it's just you just got to learn to live with it just be who we are and I think that's the most important thing just accept who you are because you are who you are and you can't change it um, I think that's the biggest thing that I've learnt is to try and accept who I am I may not like who I am much but some people seem to think I'm alright so that's good enough for me So one of my 
thoughts on today's trip? Well, I wish I had something really deep and philosophical to to say, um, but I don't. Um, you know, I stammer, therefore I am. This is probably as deep as I can go. Is you just? It's just about. You just have to learn to accept yourself, and you know, I think if you can be comfortable with yourself, um, which I'm trying to learn how to do, which is really easy for me to say, because I've never been comfortable with me, but I'm trying to be more comfortable. I've spent many years trying to get more comfortable and try to learn to live with it, and hopefully I'm finally starting to try to learn to accept who I am and what this is. Um, and I've been very fortunate um, with certain things so I guess it can't be it can't be all bad but if you're young um, if you struggle with a stammer or anything else you know please get in contact with stammer or please get in contact with somebody that you can talk to somebody that can that can help you because the best thing to do the best thing to do is to talk about it because you know there are so many people which I've learned who, who experience the same things who do the same things and it's really important that we share and we open up because it's probably more common than you think it is and on that note thank you for listening to me and please don't forget to like favorite and subscribe it really helps the channel to grow and I'll see you in the next one